Hello and welcome. I am the Suit and Tie Dip and Chew Guy and this is channel news for the 23rd of March 2020. I will be referring to notes. It is also very, very late at night. We're very, very early in the morning depending which way you want to look at it. So if I seem a little bit off, that is why. It is about five minutes to three. So first order of business, the raffle. We are at about the halfway point, maybe a little bit past for the number three raffle, March's raffle. It is for the still in packaging version of this, the Snuff Buddy with the Copenhagen sticker. It is $1 entry and up to three entries, so $3. It can be put in through the PayPal link in the description of my videos. That will be cut off at midnight this coming Thursday. All right. So, two upcoming. On Tuesday night, because I am damned if I'm going to lose the Tuesday upload right after reintroducing it, on Tuesday night there will be a alternatives video. It will be one with nicotine and one I'm sort of looking forward to because I, I'm, I have great hopes for it. So, that will be coming up in about 48 hours. <clears throat> and it will be alternatives. It will be an alternative product with nicotine. Following that, this coming Thursday, besides the wrapping up at midnight, which there will be no video actually for that, of the raffle, there will be a chew review on Thursday. On Friday, I will do the drawing for the raffle it will probably be pre-recorded after that absolute train wreck of trying to do it live last time, all right? And then on Sunday, there will be another short format dip review. In other news, and I'm gonna drop it here, partly because I want people to know that it exists, although I am not really overly pushing it at this time due to the current world situation, I did want to leave here news for my patron subscribers. Uh, there will be the entry besides the beef jerky reviews of pop reviews. I'm calling it pop review. In my part of the country, it's called soda, but they will be small batch pop products. There will be reviews alongside and with intermixed with the beef jerky reviews that I've already started. For those that do not know the Patreon, I am not at this time actually promoting it overly. I'm only mentioning it right now so I don't have to go do a second video over Patreon for the guys there. Um, it's another way to bring funding in for this channel, basically. Uh, it's automated. I, once somebody signs up, I don't have to keep pushing it type deal. As of right now, the reason why I am not promoting the idea or pushing the idea is because people have bigger worries, basically. Um, so, uh, you know, at some point down the road, I may push that idea, the, the idea more. Um, there are three levels of it. All of them have access to the reviews. No, they're not high price. A lot of Patreon pages, you know, it's like $5, $10, $20, something along those lines. This one is $1, $3, and $5 because I don't need anybody really giving 20 bucks. Um, it's interesting. I'm, I'm having a hard time getting used to it. It will help in the long run here. So I don't have to mention about funding a lot. But again, with everything going on right now, I'm just not really in the mood to push the old that the whole aspect. Although I do at the same time want to let you know that there are other types of videos available there. So PSAs moving on. PSAs have been going straight to their playlist. They're going unlisted, so they do not come up in my upload feed. I like seeing 
reviewable products in the thumbnail pictures on my upload feed. That said, the situation is changing for the worse, and I may do one tomorrow night. I have not decided yet, which is why I didn't previously mention it. As of right now, the alternatives on Tuesday night is the next official video. I may do a PSA tomorrow night, and it may be posted public so everybody knows it's there. Ever since the last two videos, eight and number nine, have been sent straight to the playlist, which you can, anybody can see them, but they don't pop up as a new upload. You have to go to playlists and find the public service announcement playlist, and they're there. They've got much less viewing, which is fine. If people weren't interested, but I think people are, and they just don't realize that they're over there. Anyway, there's going to be possibly the next one coming, which may possibly be Monday night, tonight, technically, is going to be of some importance. So I may do it openly. So the next one will probably be public upload so everyone sees it. I will try to keep it shorter, but I haven't had much success in that thus far. The situation, I felt optimistic, and I'm not going to turn this into the PSA. I felt optimistic all day today because I've been watching a live uh, update map, and I was noticing things that were telling me the virus didn't quite like heat. And then everything that was telling me that reversed. So I don't know if summer coming is going to really be too much of a help at this point so um moving on for now sourcing going forward i have decided that although it may become increasingly difficult not because of funding because of getting product safely anyway that i'm going to double down and go all out to carry forward with a regular three day a week, Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday uploading schedule. Keeping in mind that there may be some hiccups, I am planning on attempting to go at it and source the stuff. So people that I source from, you may be getting emails from me seeing if you can safely still continue. As for anyone wondering about the dry snuff that I had mentioned that I'd be restarting, I am also wondering about the dry snuff. It has never arrived. Uh, we're looking at oh, 12 business days now. It's not here. I don't know where it is. There's no tracking on it. But as soon as it gets here, you will know. As I said, people that I source product through expect email from me uh, but do not feel and I will make it very clear in the email that I'm pushing you to take any unnecessary risks going into public places I'll figure something else out rather than have you do that if you do not feel okay with it and that gentlemen and the sprinkling of ladies that evidently according to my analytics are here is that I am the Suntai dip and chew guy I do hope you are well please do not take any unnecessary risks no matter where you are I will return sometime soon sooner than later with more content. Do take care of yourselves, and as always, God bless.